now I'm just worried because this thing will shut off when you're recording sometimes. This our internet on here. Well, we'll keep an eye on it. So what are we gonna do with this guy? What color is there this one? This one is teal and purple. And I just want it um, All over. That's what I want. All over the all over the world. All over the hood. Got it. Got it. Got it. All right. How's everybody doing tonight? Now we have all the lights in here, so there's gonna be some shadows. Mm hmm Do you have any the cameras are so bright? I'm sorry. I just wanted to. There's no. Oh, I didn't know that that was out. I'm sorry. So. She called here in NZ. New Zealand. New What's happening? Jersey. K Bear 67. All right. This is the alcohol. Clara. All right, so here goes my heat gun. I'm gonna need that. And of course, it's not. All right. Cool, cool, cool. Tight, tight, tight. So we're first gonna start out with alcohol ink and tell the people how we prep this board. Well. As you can see, it is a um, one of our cradle boards with the uh, amazing ring on the back and our brand. Uh, we did some uh, prep work. We, we just rolled it with uh, PPG dead flat house paint. Mm -hmm. Interior dead flat. That's what it's called. PPG. Uh, and then sanded it with some 220, then some 400 sandpaper in between. Wiped it off with a little rag. Um, and then did a, um, a coat of spray gesso. And then sanded that with some 400 and we're good to go. I was half listening. You said this one is the purples and teals? Yes. All over? I'm gonna get the. You don't have any spray air over here, do you? Spray air? Yeah. The... What's spray air? So, if you guys can see that piece, uh oh, in back of me, it's brand new. I did it last night. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> She is on it with that. Do you know this is my process? Oh, what are you chewing on? Apologies. And purples. So the colors I've used of our turquoise by Ranger, Pale Aqua by Zig, and Copic Blue Green. This color is Ranger's Purple Twilight. Oh, it looks like a sad face. <laughs> beow, beow, beow. Oh. How come there's none up here? Because I haven't gotten there yet. Listen, you asked me to do this, and I won't let you down. I'm scared. 
because I'm not good at alcohol inking. to mix too much but I don't want to yeah normally you tilt it first and then you do it I know but I don't want the colors to mix too bad and I don't want it to get muddy you can always trick thank you Clara Very sunset -y. You don't mind it sunset-y. You've got to get a, uh, you know, I've already got my shoes on. Ladies and gentlemen, there are shoes in, the, in your studio, please, for me. I have this heat gun on all the way high, so... It's gonna... Whole deal is going to dry pretty fast. Thank you, Clara. It's not till Saturday, but thank you. I'll take it. Yeah, um, we'll try to go live. <laughs> maybe on, uh, maybe on Facebook. We need to move that over so you can get some more in. Then it'll be out of frame and it's fine. Penny, you're cute. 35. <laughs> Thank you very much. I will be 49. Margie, my birthday's on, it'll be Saturday, but we'll be in the middle of the ocean. Uh, Carol, there's going to be 11 of us going on this cruise. Drama llamas. <laughs> That's the intention, anyways. Yeah, seventies babies. That's for sure. I'm hoping Donnie can keep all our friends in check. Well, happy birthday to all the August and the seventies babies. Jessica's born in August. Uh, it's a five-day cruise. Mm -hmm. 
Is it too dark? Yeah, I'm not feeling that. Okay. We'll lighten it. That is so much better. It's like a little bit. Two weeks older than me. Yeah. What are you gonna do? Oh yeah, poor Hazel. We're definitely gonna get some booze. Well, we'll keep his memory alive and tell him happy birthday. And I'm sure he's checking out watching. Um, any ducks on this trip? Oh, there's 11 ducks on this trip. <laughs> We're going to take the ducks. Yeah, we'll take, uh, we have some extra ones left over. Sippy, sippy, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. <laughs> I don't know why this is beating up like this. I don't know. It's staying like that? That's weird. Well, I had the heat down, so that might be it. I have to, um, I think it's a fun texture though. I gotta reignite this guy though. We do what? Oh, I'm gonna say everybody's in there. Linda, we, 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 we promise we don't try to test you guys. <laughs> Do you want me to get some of that lightning stuff, that um, that rainbow that you liked in the other piece? That looks like Aurora Borealis. Okay. That is so fun. Man. Like an amazing sunset. JJ. So I figured out if you add some bling it to it that um, it makes a really interesting glittery look, but I don't know if you want it for this piece. Or do you, like, what's your thoughts on additives on this one? Additives? I mean, it's almost too late now because I've almost dried it all, but. What is this? Compared from this to that. But it's gonna get it's gonna get covered with gold in this. Are you okay with this line going through the middle? Um yeah. Cause there's gonna be the eyes will probably be right here and right here, right here. I just love doing these. You guys, when we get back, there's going to be two. We've come up with two different 
videos that nobody's done yet. It'll be an NBD, and that doesn't mean no big deal. It means never been done. I, I, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Not that we know of. Denise, I'm from Kansas. I'm from Wichita, Kansas. There. First one, check. Check. Oh, you know. Okay. <laughs> All right. So now the other one's going to be super bright, but it's only going to be... Um, that'll be concentrate in the middle. I think. I don't know. I'm kind of worried about this next one. It's definitely an experiment one. Since we're experimenting, I'm going to grab some bling it. Mm. Stone coats in the house. What's up, Mike? Or Mitch? What? I didn't even notice that. Where are you guys at here? What's up? So, Mike, I have, um, or Mitch, or all of you guys, um, I've got, I might, I might hold off on this one until we come to Oregon. Um, just because it's, it's such a fun concept and, and such an awesome idea that uh, I, I might save it for you. It might, it might be like a, either a, it's amazing concept or that was the stupidest thing I've ever seen concept. But uh, <laughs> I think it'll be cool. Do you show them your latest glass? Stone coat finish piece. With the drips on them. Right up front, babe, yeah. They're up there, right there. Well, I can't see because your arms are in the way. Perfect finish. Just mirror for days. And what about the the uh, the Asian girl face? Let's see that one. That one's a little bit smaller. And you guys, that one that she just showed you is for sale tonight. It, it might be a little little bit more than the others, but I'm trying to make a little walking around money for this cruise that we're about to go on. So, uh, and here's the other one. Look at that. Just glass with those very faint uh, hexagons you can see there. This one is sold Shane. by Shane, Mr. Shane Stoner, everybody. We'll be busting out the resin later in the show. Thank you. Uh, that first one, I believe, is a 21 inch. He's a 15. It's probably a 21. A 21 inch. Um, that one there, um, I'll probably let that one go for probably 375. Something like that. It didn't take long to do it. It was just a pretty quick one. JJ said, you try some of my piece? No, that's not yours, JJ. That's a, <laughs> that's a different one. That's a different one. Yours has um, the like greener eyes. Yeah. We just top coated yours again. JJ, this one is yours. And it's yours, okay. oh, yours is gold and teal, and it has lightning veins, and in it, it has those lightning veins in it. 
Look at that. You should put some heat on that. I am. Where's the... Do we not have a torch over here? No. I know I do. You want to put that heat on it since it's already hot? Right there. I'll do a little bit more. You had a Cujo hair in your piece. So, back to the odds. All right, B, so this one you just want reds and pinks and yellows through the the middle of it? No, I want it to go all over because I'm going to spray, um, I'm going to do black. I'm going to fade black and then do gold honeycomb on top of that. Okay. Uh, Stone Co. We, uh, we, what does he say? I look forward to, oh yeah. Oh yeah, the, the collab in, in uh, October at Stone Co. is going to be awesome. Nobody even knows how great that's going to be. <laughs> you can't even see the orange. That's so weird. This is a little, what is that, 15? Mm -hmm. This is a little 15. Yeah, Mike, this time I might be a little bit more prepared. For Vegas? For Vegas, but who knows? I kind of like to wing it. <laughs> Uh, Susan, we did. We uh, we sprayed the alcohol ink with Kamar varnish. Kamar varnish. Kamar varnish. Thank you, Rusty. Where's my button at? I need to have it on my on the computer because I have a speaker now right next to it. Hold on a second. Yeah. Thank you, Rusty. Really appreciate it, Rusty. No idea how much that helps our channel. Not he found it. Thank you very much. And I did a little experimentation today. Of my own. Um, that guy, Mike Art, who does the, the, a lot of the texture stuff. Um, I like how he's got the texture and the shiny and and, and all that kind of jizzer jazzer. Um, I've always wanted to do something similar, but with just flat and shiny. And um, I have one I did today. And I will show it to you. I did it with uh, with quick coat because it's black. I used uh, that black, some coat black. I'm walking around money. 
Thank you, Rusty. Well, usually we say all money that comes in through YouTube goes right back into the channel, but since it's designated walking around, then... <laughs> That's what we're talking about. I think I want it to be more concentrated. Like in the middle. So you want more brighter colors here? Like, because like, it's going to be the eyes, and then this is going to be... All right. Yeah. We can do that. Oh, yeah, look at that. That's fun. See, that's what I would do. I would just put it all over like that and just slip it blocky around. Order the eye stencils. You did? Are they up on the website? Mm -hmm. Holy cow. You guys, the eye stencils are up on the. <laughs> but there's only like a few of the full face stencils. Yeah. Just heads up. And then there's like 15 of the eye stencils. Can I put a little purple in this or is this, that too this dark? A pack of stencils, maybe next batch. Oh, wow. What's that? Said so would adding purple be too much? No, I would add purple and add some teal and I just mm -hmm. thought you were, I just meant like just bright colors all, all over. Well, purple. I like how this looks, like how it's like, like a sunset. Well, I can let it sit here. Deborah Rossi says, Erica, you make this look so easy. Literally, if I can do it, anyone can do it. And I know that's so cliche to say, but that's and Richards, what? Hit that button. Thank you very much. You Thank you, Ann. Appreciate that sippy sippy money. want to let it set like that like okay i mean will it does it work that way or you have to it will it? work that way but it's gonna have to soak it's gonna take that a couple of seconds let me try it. let me try it Y'all, I am now on questions and quadrants. Questions and quadrants. Oh. Is that how it goes, Bowie? Well, because there's a thing there. Joe's watching another channel today, and the gal likes to keep secrets too. Keep you watching, it's sad. It wasn't anyone in our fam. The 15 piece stencils are oh. gone. The capital gone. Well, you guys, I'm going to try to talk Jeff into going back up to Makers tomorrow. Come here, please. Well, um, I'm possibly going to be doing them in plastic. Just be more durable. Yes, but they'll be a they'll they'll be a little bit more expensive, but I will make them in uh, what do you call it? What's that called? Support. Yeah. I gotta get up early, go get the tank tops. It's really sad when people don't share their information. Like, what's the point of having videos if you don't want to? Well, inspiring people and 
helping people to create artwork or two different things? Cujo. Miss, miss, where are you going? Was he just having fun? I don't know. <laughs> he didn't do the noise. No. Hey, you okay? No. Cujo acting a little crazy over there. Yeah, I have some. I'll show you guys the plastic ones here in a second. Look at that. How fun is that? Or they're only sharing on Patreon. I know. Sharing on Patreon is good. But I feel like if you're, I want to really help people and sometimes people can't afford the cost of these materials and to throw money at Patreon, I you. wouldn't even. I'm, gonna, I'm just going to, no? What are you going to do? Do you? I like it. I'm just asking what your plan is. Bowie, calm down. I just think it looks really awesome. Like a sherbet. I know, but I'm just, um. You're gonna just add a splash? Ooh. All right, so what I'm gonna do with this one is I'm gonna take black and I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go dark and fade it and go dark and fade it. So there's a strip right here of this color left. Then I'm going to put the eyes down and do all the airbrush stuff to it. And then kind of yeah. fade that black into the eyes so it's kind of smoky looking. That's what it, that's what I feel like it's going to look like in my head. <laughs> I can't promise anything. Um, I do have a face stencil that would look good on this because this is smaller. Um, get, get the, uh, plastic stencils. There's some over there. Yes, sure, Bert. So maybe I'll do, they should be. All right. So this face is just perfect for this. So. No, I don't, I don't see him. All I have is eyes and Or I just don't know what they look like. Glowfish, I agree that, I mean, you can obviously keep some things to yourself for sure. But, um. Yeah, if you don't want to share your ideas, don't worry about it. That's the fun part of when people don't share. We like to try to figure it out. That's also true. We like to share, but there's absolutely some things that people want to keep to themselves, and that's absolutely within, like, their right to do so. I just, I prefer to share. And it definitely gives me a challenge when people aren't sharing how they do things, and I get to try to figure it out. You inspire hope. I hope so. Well, just imagine those stencils, the ones that I have. But in <laughs> these. A starting plastic. Oh, here's one. This is a um, in a plastic that I made. Um, 
obviously I messed it up cutting it that way, but um, but that's the plastic. It's very durable. To wipe it very off, good. A lot easier. So the set of fifteen isn't the only stencil we have on the site. The, there's also the eye set. I'm a little red one. All right, so these are what's on the website. If the other ones are gone, this is what's up there now. Why is that so dark? Now I have to figure out how to ship them. So, this is what I'm thinking. I'm thinking a circle. I'm thinking I'll just do a circle, a black around here. And then do the honeycomb just on the outside in a circle. That would be fun. Mm hmm Well, we're here for you, baby cakes. Well, Joe, a lot of times it just takes a whole bunch of tests and retests and retests, but we like to do the tests so you guys don't have to. That's not to say just because it doesn't something that doesn't work for us doesn't mean that it won't work for you guys at home. Do you see that slight shimmer? That's from adding bling it. I use the power black. The pearl eye pearl gold the interference pearl in this one. This is tar black. I don't want to use it. <laughs> that scares me. Well, I'm just saying because it might not dry that fast. It needs it to dry it fast. Hey Karen. Yeah, we do have to seal it first and I'm trying to see if he's got them. It's not over here. Yes, it is. So to seal it, I'm going to spray it with this UV archival from Krylon and Matt. Very important to do the matte. inspiring Bowie to get out of the fallout zone for the spray paint. You don't mind if I personally deliver the stencil, Linda? If I could, I would personally deliver to all the fans. This stuff dries so quick, it's amazing. I don't know if I'm going to do that. I'm afraid it's going to be too dark. Where's the, uh, I definitely the accept dark. all thumbs, sharing, commenting, etc. Like, we appreciate it when people um, tip the channel and donate and things like that, but absolutely is not necessary to support us. A simple thumbs up will do it. Sharing a video will do it. Yeah, I'll just do these because I want to do it like that. I don't want to do that. I'm glad you're here, Karen. We will have an awesome vacation. It will be nice to... All right, we're going to do just the set of eyes. Unplug. I don't want to do the whole face. I'm not feeling that shit. You say just yet? I don't want to do the whole face on this one. All right, so I'm going to do what I was doing the other day. I'm going to do black. Um, 
and then I'm going to come in with the uh, the gold. Uh, what do you call it? Honeycomb. Honeycomb. Yeah. How did you start your art? So Jeff has been arting since he could hold a pencil. And we have a running joke that he learned to draw formally in math and science class. Math and English. Sorry, English. And science, though, too. Oh, and also science. And I actually have a degree in art, but I wasn't using it. I had a grown-up job until I met Jeffrey here. And he reignited my passion for art. Why are you using UV and not the camera varnish? And I recently discovered that the UV works better than the camera varnish. Sometimes the varnish um, bleeds a little bit, and I haven't had that issue with the UV. I see you, Clara. Hi, Margo. I'm running out of paint. I had a vacation in New York and then a sad trip to Vegas. What is a sad trip to Vegas? You didn't bring home the money? I'm going to go steal this in. Okay. okay. Yeah, do that by the window. That's. I'm going to bring, I'm going to take this over here. I don't want to spray this by the laptop. Ooh, that. Wow. This whole like internet shopping thing is super exhausting. It sh it sucks because you don't know when it's happening. I'm about to just switch to your phone. Is it really just dropping? No, it's on now. Sorry, y'all. If I have time tomorrow, I'll go through and just make this all just one video if it's broken up into different parts, like I feel like it has. But we're going to hardwire our internet over here. I don't know what the deal is, but we'll figure it out. It's a double fade. Uh, I'm not sure, Don. I will check them. What's that? If I got the text she sent me. What do you need from me? Nothing. Not a mess, are you? So we're thinking about adding the um, hexagon stencil to the website as well. Is that something you guys would be interested in? I mean, oh, we could go that way. I don't know.
No sound, yes please. It's amazing already. Hey, Ravonda, how are you? We are great. Yes, honey, come definitely. Are you going to put more of the 15 stencils on the website too? Because I'm going to hold off and get one if so and save on shipping. Um, yeah, we're going to. 15 stencils? You put 15 sets up there? The set of 15. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know why it keeps dropping, but I'll be on the phone with AT&T tomorrow like I have nothing else to do. Um, we will add the honeycombs to the website as well as more of the multiple stencil packs. I just have to wait until Jeff goes up to the... Uh, to the makers. I'm gonna use airbrush for this. Linda said, ain't I mountain high enough? Ain't I value low enough to keep me from getting back to a D. <laughs> I love what you did. I learned so much from you people. Well, I am so glad, Don. Can't wait to see you, by the way. Hey, Scarlett. Y'all, we're going to have more up in a minute. It's not one run and done, I don't think. I almost took a sippy out of this can of spray paint. That would not have been fun. Scarlett, there's um, a set of eyes here. It's not the set of eyes that's gone. It's the... Where was one? The complete set of 15. Did anyone do some acting today? Acting? Hi, Diane. Sorry about all the drops. So is this the third video that's going to be up tonight? I don't know. But I'm just going to go in and edit it down to one. I'm just going to pull all three and condense them. I arted, if that's what you're talking about. I did not act anywhere, though. <laughs> you still doing warm up? I was going to let them watch you warm up if you were. Oh, yeah, I'm going to just. Oh, yes, art. Keeps out. Don says Clara acted like a tired person and took a nap. JJ said I acted like I wanted to be at work. Seems like there's a lot of people acting in here today. And I've got to get a new needle, or I probably should just get a new airbrush. This thing is like, paint should have already been coming out. Probably should put a little oil. There we go. That's a little better. Thank you. 
guess I better have them backwards. It's a little different with airbrush. I'm gonna I'm gonna do the center really dark. Why is this not wanting to and I turn them? Ceramic, I love it. Even cleaning his airbrush is a cool look. Ha, ah, everything Jeff does is gold. I concur. Shop then drop. I want to shop and drop. Look at you, Clara. You are a busy, busy bee. Joe tried to fix his piece I totally ruined the other day. We have at least one of those a week, I'm pretty sure. JJ is doing pretty great AIs for sure. Linda, send me a DM with your um, arting. I want to see it. Oh no, I haven't even almost done packing yet. I haven't even done the laundry to put in some case. I did re glue my hair though in preparation for the ocean. I remember, remember we used to do those crazy like Are you gonna blur blurry. This one? No, because I, I need it to be a little more stable. I don't want to. Nah. I'm starting to get the hang of AIs. At least they don't look like muddy unicorn murder scenes anymore. I've done some of those. She has. I've definitely done some of those. What's up, Roxy? Thank you. Sweet sour cream. You can have unicorns, just not bloody death unicorns. Not bloody muddy death unicorns. Is that, that's, that's kind of hard to see, huh? No? In there. Well, it's I can't like. <laughs> I'm not a fan of that angle. Can you like pull it this way and then turn it? Sorry, y'all. I'm just I'm trying to make this to where you guys will be able to see it and I'll be able to paint it. Is it there? Is it not in your eye? There probably is a market for your murdy, you know, muddy murder unicorn scenes. There's a market for everything. That is true. Linda tried her first AI the other day. Hands look better than the canvases. Um, this is like super annoying. I feel like I, I would be a doctor. They can see you do that. Mm. And that's all that shows is the camera right there. Like, all right, so I'm gonna do this one a little different. Hi, Gary. I'm gonna start with, with the shadows first. Is this part of the blob set? I mean, the yeah, all splash. these are all these are. Um, a part of what you get in the uh, multi pack. In the multi pack. Dr. Thornton is in, y'all. Hey, Carol. Girl, order pizza. Melody, are you talking about true color for this piece or a different one? Also, I love that your name is Melody and your avatar is a music show. 
I'm using uh, carbon black for this right here. And if you if you if you can't see it's because I'm barely putting it uh, putting it down because I'm gonna come back with the shading gray. And once that shading gray hits it, it'll darken up pretty quickly. So that's why I'm just I'm just trying to get these hard lines first. Yeah, I'm going to link these videos to the listing, like the purchase listing for the stencils so that you guys have something to reference back to. Don wants to know what ink you're using in your airbrush. Is it special? Uh, it's not. Um... I'm just using Comart. It's really, really good uh, airbrush paint. Um, I think it comes with some airbrushes. It does come with some uh, some of the uh, Iwata packs. Like you can get a brush, a hose, and like three or four colors. Sometimes, I, I'm, I'm not sure. I think I actually got these online. I got like a, a set um, with different colors. I don't know. Some do, some red, don't. Blue, yellow, and black will come this is just it. this is just opaque black, but it's really good. And they have this amazing um, transparent smoke. If you're patient and you want your artwork to look like a photograph, this is the stuff to use. You start out with this in your airbrush, and you get all of the shadows that you want to that you want to get, and then add a little carbon black, just a little bit to it. And then add a little bit more and a little bit more. Or you can get the transparent black and then add to black to that. And that's, that's the transparent black is still um, very, very light transparent. I want these to be like super smoky, so that's why I'm I'm starting out with the with the with the black. How many of y'all have an airbrush out there? Right, See you, Margo. Sorry for all the movement. I'm gonna I'm gonna have to move this because I can't get. Um, can't get there. I can't get to where. That looks good. It's not very bright though. Like it's because there's too much light back there. Bring that up and do a little bit of uh, what do you call it? No, no. What? Um, is that it? Yeah, yeah. overhead. Double click. No, what? The gain. There you go. All right, now I can get a little closer. Uh, a little happier. I can clean my glasses off. It looks like a lot of you guys have an airbrush or a plan to get an airbrush. Seems like this is awesome. That glare from that light, I'm not used to all that light, like that directly, one? yeah, like directly, I need it in, over here, though. So, some of you even have an Iwata. That's what Jeff prefers to use. Um, he has the gravity feed, which means that his little cup of paint is on the top. Yeah. There's also a siphon bed which has the paint on the bottom of it. It just comes up through the bottom. You have to you have to have a, a special cup for that. Jeff prefers the gravity. Seems like a lot of people only have them to blow air around on alcohol inks, acrylics, or resin. Which is not a bad use, but since you have it anyways, you may as well um fiddle with adding a new medium to your repertoire right yeah bye sue have a great day
this little splash. Man, this is not. The paint is not coming out like I would like it to. I think it's because I can't really see. Like, I, I think it's. I'm not used to painting like this. Do you want me to adjust any of the lights? No, because then everything will be thrown off. Okay. Um, do you recommend any good airbrush tutorials? Do you have any? Um, I, I don't really have any tutorials. Like, if you want to know something now, ask me now. <laughs> but, uh... Yeah, I can't, I can't, like, get in, like, it's hard for me to see detail because the light coming from in front of me, it's, like, super gnarly. Hold on, you can't, you can't mess with that, though. I'm just going to move it to over here. That's just going to be worse. Mm, I don't know. No, it's the same. It's just at that angle. Like, it's just, it's still like the glasses, the glare. Mm -mm. Just, I'll deal with it. Can I move it further back? No. Where do you want them? Just leave it right there where it was at. I mean, there's nothing we can do about it. It's just, that's where the lighting's got to go. Um, do you have any listed in your Amazon? I'm sorry, Don. Do I have any listed what, what? I'm trying to lose, learn on my wood art. Um, Linda, we put these stencils that he's using right now available for purchase earlier today. They are already all gone, but I'm going to do my best to convince Jeff to go to Makers tomorrow and make some more if he has time. Um, but we'll see because tomorrow's going to be really busy. Um, every day until we leave, it's going to be busy. But if you're subscribed to our website, then I'll send out a big email tomorrow and let people know. This is driving me insane. Like, there's supposed to be paint coming out right when I do that, and look, like, my hand is, like, like, that is not a good time. I don't understand what the deal is. We just need to get you a new one. Hey, Gina. Oh, this is frustrating. All right, let me see. Where's my... Linda just made a jalapeno margarita. Awesome. Tink. Claire, you weren't gone long. Cheers, Diane. Um, Linda, I'll have them up soon. I promise. What's up, cat? No worries. We had technical difficulties in the beginning anyways. And a little bit still. Cats, are you saying that you're mixing beer and Dr. Pepper or cheers with Dr. Pepper? I just want to use these stencils to cut crease my own eyeballs. But I know it won't work. But I wish it could. It would work. That's what. Don't they do that? A lot of people use a spoon. Um, 
Stone Coat's going live tomorrow. Awesome. I think we're going to pre-post, like, post a pre-recorded video tomorrow. Yay, eyebrow hairs. Yeah, see, it's like, I can't even, it's, it's not responding. That's so frustrating. Like, I know when it, the paint's supposed to come out. So now I'm having to pull back even more, and that makes me nervous because once you when you start pulling back on this trigger, more paint comes out. And it's just not coming out when I think it's going to come out. No fun. But we just won't put too much detail where the fine lines are. Yeah. I'll just use the hand stencils a little bit more. Pardon, Julie? Pardon? Can you get a new one overnight? Um, new one what? A new airbrush? Nah. I don't think. I don't think. I don't. Can. I'm. I'll deal with it. I've. I've used them. <laughs> I've used airbrushes so long that I don't, I mean, I'm not, it's just when I'm doing it live and it, it's not coming out, so it's a little frustrating, so I'll be, I'll be all right, I promise you. He just likes things to be perfect for y'all. Just when you're explaining something and it's not doing what you're explaining, that's a little frustrating. Gina says, it's still looking amazing. I don't, even, I don't even see how you guys can see it. It's so dark. No, you can you can tell you're building it. How do you tell if your needle is blunt? Um, because you can't get a... Uh, um, Oh, my easel's in the way. That's why. All right, let's do this. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this. How do you tell if your needle is blunt? Um, because of how how the paint will sputter when it comes out. Jeff, your bad day is better than most good days airbrushing. Thank you very much. Hi, Elena. How have you been? What kind of pencil is that? Just a Prismacolor. Have you tried your scratchy thing on this yet? I have. No, I'm not using it. How do you know where to add these white highlights? Because the picture that I used, I've done it a couple times now, so I kind of just know where they're at. Um, so let's see here. Yeah, this is a new piece. That sounds deadly, Diane. I'm going to put the white highlights here. If you just continually add just a little bit of white to 
certain areas that are that, that's highlight um, they'll stay white and then you can continue to see where to put highlights and it just makes it look a little more natural I know. That's why I'm on your phone. What's wrong? Oh, it stopped? I know, but it went to stop and I pulled it up on your phone, so it's streaming on your phone now. I'll be on the phone with them first thing in the morning. Hey y'all, sorry it keeps dropping, but I'll have it fixed tomorrow. It's like super annoying. I love that she has purple eyes this time. What kind yes. of marker is that? It's a Posca brush pen. It looks like an eyeliner pen. Don't shake too hard because it's going to splatter. Well, you, if you hold that down, it will. I'll probably make these pupils a lot bigger, so... I'm going to do the eyelashes and then I will spray the other face. Rusty yeah. said, now if I can make the eyes look half as good as yours. Funny, I can sculpt an eye, but can't draw one. That's crazy. those lashes that come into the eye or the reflection of lashes. I'm gonna have to make this pupil bigger. How do you decide how big to make a pupil? Because it needs to be like you just can tell that it needs to be bigger. Like it needs to take up 
A third. More of the eye. What up, Clara? Like, that makes not people not want to watch our channel if it does that. I know, but I'm going to take all three down, put them together, and repost it as a time lapse. Don't tell me this brush is drying out. Maybe you just have to click the end of it or whatever. I keep looking over there letting me see how it looks. JJ said we'd watch it even if it was in a million pieces, Jeff. So you have two of these. So that's, well, I had two of them. I haven't taken any of those ones. I didn't even know you had them. I think it just takes time and experience to know where to shadow and create light. That's true, and oftentimes it comes down to your reference. Linda says, I don't know, it's kind of exciting and fun chasing you all over YouTube. Keeps the relationship fresh. Deborah says, I'm glad you're dedicated enough to keep coming back. I'm loving this. too. I like anything with purple in it for sure though. Absolutely, Clara. How many faces do you think you've painted in your lifetime? Thousands. Like I've had, I've, had, I've, I have so many portraits. I've done so many. I mean, it has to be. I mean, I would have to say it's more than more than a thousand. Like I don't like. If I think about how long I've been painting and like where I've put them up and or if I've sold them or gave them to somebody or threw them away or I love how you always do long lashes. Makes me happy. All right, let's spray that other one. Okay. Mm -mm, put that up there. This is, is going to be... All right. Let's see. Which ones do we want to use for that? I don't know if... We, like... That's, like, way really too big, right? This is the same size as that one. Can I use this one? Mm-hmm. It shows, Jeff, amazing talent like that doesn't come after 10 or 20 pieces. Oh, yeah, yeah. This looks like such a mysterious lady. How beautiful. I could watch Jeff for hours. My husband gets concerned when I'm quiet this long. <laughs> I 
Oh, I am definitely fluent in typos. Trying not to move so much so it doesn't get all choppy on y'all. So that was Super 77 spray adhesive. So he doesn't put too much pressure down because he doesn't want to rip the stencil when he pulls it off. He's just tapping down the edges so tap, that... Tap, tap, tap. tap. Just chop what, the edges. What is that from? Tap, tap. Tap, tap, I don't know. A little tap, tap, tappy, tap. Somebody else will say it. I'm sure JJ will say it. Or Clara. Van. Her movie bus. That is not EPO paper. I think that's just a, that's just printer paper. Yeah, it's just regular old printer paper. Carbon black, does it? I wonder if I just didn't mix it up enough. Carbon black should be like black, like that is that is not carbon black. No, maybe a couple coats will make it carbon no, black. I'm not gonna, I'm gonna, I don't mind it because I'm going to go over this anyway. I'm just carving it out now. Diane said, I wish I had brows. Shane Gray. Yeah, I always look like I don't have any eyebrows on if I don't darken them. I don't have really any arm hair either. Oh my God, it looks like you have a creepy little three nostril nose on it from here. Ew. Mm -mm. I can't with you right now. My canness has expired. <laughs> I don't even know what to do with you. That's a little bit more carbon black. See the difference? 
It's way different. Mm -hmm. They're like, yeah, whatever, bro. Excuses, excuses. The start of something beautiful. She's watching. This is driving me insane. Like, my finger is like indented, like this part, because I'm holding it down so damn hard. Like, it's almost uncomfortable. And then I'm just wasting paint. I've never heard of that medication. It's going to be creepy walking around your place with all those eyes. Nah. Put them in the dust free zone. I don't I'm, I can I'm see never, that, Linda. I've never really understood how people got creeped out about it. Like, I think it's awesome, like, to think about if some eyes are moving and watching. <laughs> mm mm. I always think of the, the cartoons like uh, Scooby Doo, how the, how the, uh, what do you call it? They always watched you, so I always try to, I always try to do that. Like I've done a couple paintings where wherever you stand, they'll look at you. Who bought that last one? I do not, I'm not digging this. Is it slowly, slowly. I'm sorry, B. not coming out when I'm doing that and that's what you get. You get shitty squatty eyelashes. No room for that in Dallas. I would get lost in all the ways that stencil can be used.
What eyes do you guys think you should add to this one? Like basically all I can use it for is just blowing color out. <laughs> and that is like super frustrating. JJ said, you know how when the food's so good and nobody's saying a word at dinner? That's what it's like watching Jeff art. <laughs> it did get super quiet when you started airbrushing. Thanks y'all, too sweet. Everyone is agreeing. JJ, I'm watching. Can Jeff do some airbrush teaching videos? I want to airbrush along with him, see if what I make turns out looking like what he makes. I'm thinking not. It well, just takes time if, and practice. If you've, if you've never airbrushed, it's, it, it's a little difficult to get used to. Um, Erica picked it up pretty fast. Um, she did really good on the first time she, she used it. Um, but I was right there just like, yes and no, and don't do this, do that. And, Hey, Allie. I just get nervous because I'm not you know, professionally trained or whatever. So it's hard to, to describe how to do something or why something looks, you know, especially for anatomy. It's very, uh, very intimidating just talking about what should go where, why it should do that. It's, you've done it so many times, you know, you just kind of know where stuff goes and So it's just, I would just be like, if you want to come, I'm going to be doing this. probably doing some questions. If you guys want to bring some airbrushes, 
I don't know. It would it would really depend on It'd the be time more like frame. a workshop. Yeah. Linda says you are talent trained. Baby Cake says don't feel bad, you're awesome. Well, thank you guys. Claire said just teach the techniques and let people try them. <clears throat> Carol says that was smoking like a true artist. Misty says, Jeff, you said exactly what my teacher said. Hmm. What color are you looking for? Don says, looks like vampire eyes. Diane says, we'll bring all our air guns and pile on you guys. Julie said she would definitely watch the tutorial. If you guys do that, if you guys do use a marker inside of a, a stencil like this and it's kind of raised a little bit, get in there, do your circle, take it off. Because if you if you mess around and do that, do it again, it'll odds odds are it'll move and, and you'll smear your paint. Because paint is right on the edge and it'll go, it'll get right underneath. Do your line, bring it out, and then deal with it, you know, deal with that later. And you either color it in or you know, make, make something darker. Would silicone finger F1 airbrushing? I don't know that he's ever tried those. What? Have you ever tried to look on finger grips to airbrushing? They're like finger condoms, I think, but they're silicone. No. It's just pressure. Right, it gives some padding though. Holding I don't I don't know. I think Jeff needs to feel Yeah, it's a, a lot of a feeling. That was a good thought though. Tammy said, if we will be in town, would we be able to meet you guys? Tammy, are you talking about this town? Are you coming to Dallas? It's kind of like in ballet, and if you ever did point, like you want to pose, but you can't do too much because you have to be able to feel the floor. When are you coming to town, Tammy? If we're here, you're welcome to come by the studio. Gina, it was a great idea, though. It doesn't look like any color's coming out. It's not. It's hair. Just some hair. Carol, we've been pulling some long days lately. I've got to go get that. What? MP3 uh, zip uh, USB drive two to nine. If he doesn't work tomorrow, then we're gonna be gone Friday. Okay, we'll just get all the airbrushing done and then that we'll top coat and add things tomorrow. Probably be an early. I might do I might do white airbrush with this one. You guys really need this holiday. You don't even know sour cream. That is for real. You may need to rest before you go on your cruise. That is also a true statement. We However, a cruise away from our cruise. Um. 
sleep on the way down to the port. Riding with four or five other people, that's going to be cute. I don't think I'm going to allow that. I'm going to have the judge throw that out as we speak. Did you just throw out my Mimi? Yep. That's rude. I'll get some sleep tonight. As soon as this video is over and I walk the boys and do seven loads of laundry and... Seven loads of laundry. Um... <laughs> All these things. Hey, Popo. Hi, Moon Mare. cute, babe. That was cute. Hey, peepees. On a vacation after my vacation. Thing about it is, after our vacation, we have to go to Jeff's um, year class reunion. Five year? Joe. <laughs> and. How was that a joke? Because it's not serious. The only it's other option so is funny. joke. You think is joke. It has to be funny to be a joke. Um. So we're going to his reunion and we're gonna do demos there because Kansas needs to know about resin or Wichita over there, and then then I'll take a nap. I'm going to try to airbrush holding. Huh? This is a little difficult, but I'm going to try. Oh, must go on. Firing a little bit. Sorry, y'all, but we're back. Well, we are sorry about the internet thing. I'm blown away that it just keeps doing that. one a little, a little more cartoony, spacey more. Let's see here, where's my blue at? Oh, I hate that I can't see what you guys see. I don't even know if you're still on. 
<laughs> Sorry, I'm not, I can't, the, the, uh, this camera is like five feet over my, six feet, something like that. One of those. All right, where's my white at? I got one white one time and it was like super transparent, which I was not happy about. All right. So I normally don't use white. It kind of makes your, your artwork look cartoony. When, but when you're doing something like this with color and there's white in the background and very translucent, I don't mind using white. It, it brings it out a little bit more and I'm starting to get irritated with the internet and with this airbrush and I, I don't want to start skipping stuff and like rushing. So this white, I'm going to do some white on here and then call it quits I'll let you guys go I appreciate you guys coming back three or four times <laughs> I'm no idea why the internet is acting the way it is but what are you gonna do Takes me back to when I used to do t-shirts. This is, I put way, it's way too dark in these areas. Inject that all up. There's no coming back from that one. It's starting to look like a comic book to your character. I'm just checking out your guys' conversation there. <laughs>
See, that's what makes it look very cartoony. Is this. I'm painting on a motorcycle right now. I don't even know if you guys can see what I'm doing. Looks like an airbrush t-shirt. <laughs> well, I'm about ready to get off here. You guys are awesome for sticking around while you have. Maybe I'll do some cartoon stuff to this. Maybe add some hair. knows <laughs> it's like a it's like a filter on Facebook very dreamy I appreciate it you guys all right sorry for all the uh, interruptions and I don't know if you guys can see me <laughs> um, I'm not sure what time what is tomorrow Thursday the day before we leave for our cruise um, she has got this so cockeyed over here. I don't know how this is even staying up. Um, let me see if I can maybe point this more at myself here. Um, so yeah, thank you. I apologize for all the downstreaming and all that, or whatever that's called. I don't know, internet outage. Um, thank you. Tomorrow we'll be back probably early. I'm, I'm not sure. Um, she might just post a video um, or maybe just a quick one. Um, so yeah. Um, make sure you guys, uh, I think Stone Coat's live tomorrow, so make sure you check them out. I'm not sure what time though. Whenever they go live, they normally have something pretty important to say, so. Um, I guess that's it. Be kind to one another. You never know what somebody's going through. Um, this one will be for sale. <laughs> this one will be for sale. Maybe I'll make this a galaxy. Maybe I'll just do little stars all over it or something. I don't know. Um, that one that I painted. I don't know why this is so difficult to turn. Uh, that one there is definitely for sale. If you guys can see that. You cannot, of course you can't. Um, that one there is for sale. It's a, I want to say a 21 inch. And I think I have uh, 375 on it or four, something like that. I'm not sure. Um, the small one will probably be around 125, 150. Um, so yeah, there you go. You guys are awesome. Um, so yeah, we'll probably put it on uh, our ATD's Poor People group on Facebook. 
uh, what time we'll go live. We just got a lot of stuff to do. I'll be at Makers making stuff, making your stencils, making more coasters, getting stuff ready for our cruise. Um, and if you don't know, we leave for a cruise uh, on Friday. We'll be back the 20, no, the first, because I have to go to my 30 year high school reunion and do a demo in Wichita, Kansas at Maxine's off of Douglas. I hope that's what it is. Um, Uh, we're going to do Boards by Brittany. She does awesome signs. She does awesome sign parties, drink and paint parties kind of thing. Um, so if you're in Kansas or in Wichita, go check out Maxine's. I'm sure she'll be there painting some boards up. Um, you guys have an awesome night. We'll see you tomorrow. Bye.